Hey everyone, I'm going to give you a rundown of what I do with my hair daily, which is mostly straightening. Um, the reason why I'm doing this is because a lot of people ask me about my hair, so I figure why not show it off. So what I first do is I take a comb and I start from the bottom and work my way to the top. That way, when you're starting from the top, you don't just rip out all your hair. And as you can see, hopefully my hair isn't completely wet. It's towel dried and air dried for a bit. What I do next is I put a heat protectant spray in my hair. What I use, I use two different ones actually. What I use for blow drying is Tresemme Thermal Creations Heat Tamer Spray. And this will obviously protect your hair from using hot tools like a curling iron and a straightener. Another thing you want to do when you're putting like, hairspray or spray on products is make sure that it doesn't get on your face. So what you do is you kind of just shield it away. The product can be really bad for your skin. And it did cause me to break out before because it got on my face. So. I'm just going to give you guys a heads up about that. Okay, and then I'm going to spray a little bit on my comb just so that it gets in there real good. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is blow dry. Okay, now that my hair is dry, I'm going to just run my comb through it again because it got all tangled. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is use my second heat protectant spray. Um, the one I use for straightening is the Chi. This is... 44 Iron Guard Thermal Protection Spray and I got this as a gift which is the reason why I use this and I love it because I use a cheese straightener. I've had that thing for about two years and I wouldn't get rid of it for the world. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and spray this in my hair. And when you put heat protectant spray, you want to let it dry first before you straighten or curl your hair because you don't want that sizzling effect and it pretty much sounds like your hair is on a grill, frying pan or something. Okay, so the heat protectant spray has dried in my hair. Now, the reason why I don't clip up my hair like, you're, like you should actually when you strain your hair is because most of the mornings I'm in a rush, so I just make sure that everything's straightened. Okay, so this is what my hair looks like after I've straightened it and everything. I haven't put product in it yet, so what I'm going to use first is Garnier Fructi Sleep and Shine. It comes in a little small bottle like this. You don't want to put a lot of this in your hair because what will happen is that it will make your hair look really greasy because this is pretty much oil. So I use this to tame the flyaways and the frizz. 
and to make it shiny and smooth. Okay, and what I use last is Herbal Essence Breaks, Breaks Over, and this is a strengthening leave-in cream because my hair is prone to split ends, so I like to use it. It makes my hair really soft, so it's my favorite right now. And I've been using this for about six months, and you want about maybe that much. You don't want a lot. But if your hair is longer, you do want to use a little bit more, just to make sure your whole hair is covered. And it's all smooth, it's shiny, it's soft. So, that's my daily hair routine. It takes me about 15-20 minutes, depending. And I hope you enjoyed it, and I'm hoping to have more videos to come, so stay tuned. Thanks, bye.